Curtis Clark Hale Jr. was packing up to head to his son's wedding when he got a call that his son's dog, Lucy, had escaped a pet resort in Round Rock. When you're driving up and down 79 looking for a white animal and there's a lot of white garbage on the side of the road, it stops your heart every time you see a piece of trash. After searching for hours and not seeing her at all, he met up with volunteers from Jack Jack's Pack Street Dog Rescue. They had located her. We could see her. Hiding and um, but not running, but uh, she didn't recognize me from a distance. He says he was grateful to find her, but she wasn't herself and wasn't coming to him. We could all see looking at her that she was still in that flight mode of not recognizing even like who she is. It's like they go back to a, a primal mode where their favorite person seems like a predator. So yelling her name, throwing out food, or even walking around with squeaky toys was actually making it worse. Those things are just going to scare them off. So they used a different tactic. Get on the ground, on your stomach, um, or sit down, do not make eye contact, and just stay still. So that's what Grandpa did. We just guided Grandpa. Um, and he was amazing. He just, it was like he was a professional. He was army crawling slowly. Um, he took his time. She saw a cheeseburger, a piece of a cheeseburger in front of her. And he said, hey, Lucy, you want to eat that cheeseburger, don't you? And her little ear went up, one ear. And so we could see it was, it was that emotional side of Lucy was coming back. And she knew that was her grandpa. And then he said, you want to go home, don't you, Lucy? And then both of those ears shot up, and she, her little butt went back and forth, and her tail was wagging, and she ran to Grandpa. She says her team was going to stay for as long as it took. Now that I do this, and this is my life, that I will get th those babies home. And they did. Lucy made it to the wedding. And the newlyweds thank everyone for their help. It was definitely reassuring to hear and see that so many people cared about helping us get our girl back. And um, we just felt really blessed. Meredith Aldis, Fox 7 Austin News.